Word. name and band and all the 411. one on one style? Yeah. 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 Um, my name's Jacob. I play bass in Ready the Messenger uh, from Austin, Texas. Um, I guess you could call us Metalcore. <laughs> Okay, how long have y'all been together? Um, I've been in the band a little bit over a year now. Um, the guys were playing uh, about a year before they picked me up. I was in another band from Austin and uh, didn't really work out, so I was kind of filling in for them. They lost their bass player and just decided to stick with it. Okay, this is the second time y'all have been to Victoria. Um, and it seems like y'all had a really good response yeah. and everything. And it seems like <laughs> every time y'all y'all come to Victoria and everything, y'all are on a little weekend warrior right, type right. tour. Tell me a little bit about that. Uh, yeah, we're uh, doing weekend runs with Killing and uh, <clears throat> Killing Apathy. Um, all of us have full time jobs, so we're trying to get out as much as we can. So we're just doing um, out of town weekend dates. Uh, but yeah, we, we last time we came to Victoria, we also came with them and. Um, uh, our two guitar players, Cody and Randall, are both from Port Lavaca. I'm, I'm born and raised here, so uh, I think that definitely helps. You know, when when we come down and we reach a lot of people whenever we promote, and um, yeah, I mean, we obviously love playing here. It was such a good turnout tonight. Um, we had a great time last time, which is why we want to keep coming back. Um, the locals were incredible, uh, recreating chaos were some of the nicest guys I've ever met. Um, all the commending the fallen dudes were really, really cool as well. Um, but yeah, it was awesome. Like the, I, Again, I, I was born and raised here, so I got to see the music scene kind of come alive and die for a little bit, come alive again, and you know, I'm really glad it's getting back up there. Cool. Um, tell me a little bit about the band. Um, Music wise, you know, you said you're metalcore and everything. Right, right. Um, influences? Man, uh, everywhere really. Uh, I mean, Randall used to play guitar in a country band. I mean, I, um, yeah, everything. I mean, we can put on some super heavy blast beat shit and then listen to some fucking acoustic stuff, you know, like really everything. I mean, and I think it really comes through in our writing. Um, we have a lot of melodic stuff and a lot of heavy stuff and tough guy stuff and I really try and incorporate everything we can with it so it's it's cool I I, I love the way we write together you know again I, I've only been in the band for about a year year and a half but I love these guys writing style and everyone puts in their own opinion their own part and it's awesome cool um Releases. Do y'all have anything that y'all have out or yes. that are y'all working on? Absolutely. Uh, we have an EP entitled Fracture. Uh, it's on iTunes. You can hit us up on our big cartel, our Facebook, and get it online. Um, we are in the process of recording a three song EP. Uh, we're doing it actually with our good friend Tony from Fire from the Gods. Um, but yeah, we're, we're uh, working on those. We're these are probably some of the best songs we've written, and I, I, I'm really excited to get them out. Uh, we have some real exciting stuff planned for them, so I'm, again, we're just so excited to get them out and done. Like we, yeah. we want to get them done just so people can hear them. When do y'all plan on releasing them? Um, I'm not too sure. We're still uh, in the process of tracking. So after tracking, you know, we still have mixing and mastering we got to do, and pressing the actual CDs and everything so I'd, yeah. I'd probably give it no more than two or three months hopefully cool. shooting at the lowest <laughs> yeah um, now after this uh, weekend warrior thing that y'all have been doing and everything what uh, other plans y'all have for um, 2012 Ever, ever, anything and everything really um, I mean of course we want to get out here as much as we can um, this weekend warrior thing we've been doing just was so good to us, you know. We've we met a lot of people, played places we've never played, and in Texas, and you know, being from here, we this is such a huge state. We feel like we have to get out there, and um, yeah, hopefully, just playing more shows. We got that uh, new CD that we're going to be releasing this year. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Just playing as much as we can, recording, everything like that. Okay, um, how can anybody get in contact with you? Uh, Facebook, we have uh, Facebook, Twitter, 
um, all uh, the Twitters, RTM, Metal, uh, Facebook.com, Ready the Messenger. Um, yeah, we all have our own personal Facebooks. You can find us all on there. We'll be more than happy to talk to everybody we can. Cool. Uh, anything else to add dealing with the band, dealing with touring, dealing with what's coming up for the band? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I mean, yeah, just uh, if you can, we uh, have our EP on iTunes. You can also order a physical copy on our merch store. Um, again, we're looking to release a new CD this year, so just be on the lookout for that. Um, keep checking our Facebook for when we're coming to cities around you. Hopefully we'll be getting out a lot. and Hopefully have a good fucking Austin show booked soon. Really been wanting to play a good one home, but yeah, just look for us if you're in Texas. <laughs> cool. Well, appreciate the interview. For sure. And uh, y'all have a safe trip. Absolutely. Port Lavaca, uh, Corpus in the morning and everything. So, thank you. Thank you, man. We appreciate it. All right, guys. This song's not any younger, but we're recording right now. It should be done with like a monster. Stay tuned. This one's going to be a bit loud. This song's called The yeah. So save your bro!